Get Moving Mondays. Last week, our very own Greg Funderburg kicked off our new segment talking about his personal weight loss. Well, tonight we're exploring if cardio actually helps you lose weight. Fox Carolina's Greg Funderburg now with details. Well, guys, we have all heard the saying, the more cardio you do, the more weight you lose. Well, weight loss and fitness expert John Defenda says it's not the answer. He says the more muscle you have on your body, the greater the amount of fat burned. Defenda says long bouts of cardio workouts, whether it be running or biking for an hour or two without any variation in speed or intensity will not do much for making your body lean. He says you may drop some weight in the beginning if you are overweight and have never worked out before starting this type of program. However, you will lose muscle and fail to recover from your weight training workout. Therefore, your results will begin to plateau. The best way to burn fat is to build muscle. Muscle utilizes energy. Energy is calories. If so, if we, if, if, if we build muscle and that muscle utilizes energy, we're going to burn calories, we're going to burn fat. The process of building muscle utilizes tremendous amounts of energy. If I train the muscle, I'm breaking down that muscle. During the process of breaking it down, I'm going to burn fat. During the process of rebuilding that muscle bigger, stronger, and better, and more efficient so it can burn more fat and energy, that's what loses fat, not cardio. Cardio is not the answer. He says you should keep in mind that you can get more bang for your body at the gym by lifting weights for 30 minutes rather than running for 60 minutes. In fact, lifting weights three to four times a week for about 60 minutes each time while increasing intensity will get you the results you want to not only increase your composition in favor of the lean body mass, but to help you gain some overall health benefits such as an increase in core strength, increase in bone mineral density and lowering blood pressure, cholesterol and stabilized blood blood sugar levels. Now, as of today, I have lost 23 pounds in the past five weeks. Now, every week I will give an update on my weight at this time. During this process, I will also be writing a weekly blog on Mondays and posting healthy recipes on the page. You can simply go to foxcarolina.com and click on the interactive tab. Then you can click on my blog and see what I am up to. You can also leave your comments there or you can email me at getmoving at foxcarolina.com. Now back over to the news desk.